Hey beautiful people and a welcome back to my channel. So in today's video we are doing a traditional sewing. I have not had a traditional sewing in years so I was really excited to be getting one. So which brings us to today's sponsorship which is Curls Queen. Thank you so much for sponsoring this video. Um, they sent me this hair and along with it came this bonnet and the comb i love this bonnet because it has an adjustable strap so you can easily um adjust it so that it doesn't hurt your head or whatever the case and then you get a pamphlet that just you can fill out if you wanted to return the hair and it also gives you the hair detail so which is basically my specific bundles are two bundles being 18 inches and the texture is body wave i really wanted to try this texture because my hair is relaxed so i thought this would be the best texture to sort of like blend with my hair rather than the kinky so if you are natural i would say that you go for the more kinkier bundles as these would give off the most silky look and wouldn't easily blend with your hair if you're natural so i absolutely love these so one thing you need to know about these bundles is that they are an upgrade. I took the luxurious upgrade of 150 grams per bundle, which is also equivalent to two bundles. Uh, no, it's equivalent to three or four bundles in the market if you were to go anywhere and buy bundles and add them to your hair. It is really full. I mean, at first I looked at it and I was like, two bundles? I'm not so sure because in the past when I had done traditional sew-ins, I had used three bundles. So the first thing that I had to do was obviously prep my scalp. I have not had my hair conroed in so many months. I think since I transitioned to being relaxed, I have not done anything on my hair that involves manipulating my hair. So no braids, no, I have not worn a wig. I've just basically had my hair out for close to a year, to a year basically. So I needed to ensure that my scalp um, was ready because I hadn't washed my hair in a week so I had a little bit of dandruff so this is great for dandruff and the fact that my hair is going to be covered for a while it's just ensuring that my scalp is clean so I easily don't like itch then I had to just brush my hair out and prep it for the shower and if you notice that I wasn't brushing it from the roots but basically where my hair was visible and I washed it, went to the salon, and this is like them conroing my hair now. I had leave out, so obviously I only left out the sides of my hair and the middle because I was getting a middle parting. And then everything else towards the back was being conroed. Um, I will definitely probably try out different styles. I'll probably try a side part next. But for today, I really wanted to have a side part. Um, I mean, a middle part. And basically, this is how my conros look. And then you are going to see her sew on the bundles and the technique she used. Basically, I just showed her a video I had seen on Instagram of someone getting a weave sewn. I had noticed that the bundles went curved as they got higher and not just in a straight line. I don't know if you get what I mean, but if you just watch the process, you will understand basically what I mean because this also goes back to the styling I'm gonna be doing because I was highly influenced by TikTok to do the no heat um, curl method. So I really wanted to try it and I thought it would be a nice way to continue styling my hair if I was going to have a leave out for about four to six weeks. So I didn't want to constantly be applying heat on my hair. I just wanted to have it done. Now, do you see how that track is going all the way up? So that's basically the technique that I was talking about. And I really love how she sewed on my weave. It's exactly what I asked for. So I was really happy. So just watch the rest of the technique and then we'll also get into styling my hair later. Thank you. 
one of the reasons I was excited to collaborate with Coast Queen is because Coast Queen is a brand that signifies women's beauty, power, and self-love through hair. And just like their slogan goes, it is to be fresh, gifted, female, and black. So I know I haven't done a hair video on this channel in so long, but my first hair video just made sense collaborating with a brand that is specifically targeted at black women and is all about black women and their hair. So later in the evening when I was home, it was try time for me to try out the TikTok technique that I had seen, but I first wanted to straighten my hair out. I actually hadn't straightened it at the salon uh, because I was in a rush, but they did just curl it up a bit. So I really just wanted to get all the bundles really straight, then um, curl my hair with uh, the Benji Rollers. So the technique that I saw on TikTok TikTok is that a lot of people were using socks and I didn't really want to use socks because for me that just felt like I would be taking the moisture out of my hair because it is cotton so I think it would have been better with silk but I didn't have anything that was silk to slip all these um, bendy rollers in so I just I just basically used them as is and I tried that. I'm going to be showing you again step by step later in the video, but this was a trial run so I wasn't sure if I wanted to film the whole process, but I was ready to film the, the way it came out the next morning. Basically I just started off by removing the ones at the back and I just let my hair loose. And dropped the bendy rollers on the floor because I was recording this so I had nowhere to put them and then after that you just want a finger comb but like I really love how this came out I slept in them obviously and the one thing that I really loved is that because they're all in the center and you don't have any bendy rollers on the sides you don't really struggle to sleep unless you sleep um, facing up which I really do. I always sleep on either side. So this is how my hair looks. It looks so nice and bouncy and it has this natural wave to it. I don't know what you call this wave. It's not exactly like the body wave you get on the bundles, but it's more, um, how do I put it? It's just more simple and it just looks, I don't know, it's its giving. All I can say is that it's giving. So the TikTok girlies didn't lie. I really love this technique and I would highly recommend it. And I just wanted to go check in the mirror again just to confirm. Um, but one thing I can say is that when your bundles are new, they won't hold a curl at as long. I mean, this was the end of the night. This is how long the curls lasted. So I'd say the whole day. But I was ready to try it again for the next evening. So I think um, as you go, your hair will get better. But this hair really lasts. Apparently, if you take really good care of it, it can last up to a year. So this is why I'm not trying to use too much heat on it. One thing that I loved is that when I was brushing, I did not notice any shedding. Um, in the past, with a lot of like hair, usually you notice a lot of shedding. And another technique that um, she, the lady that installed my weave uses is that she didn't cut 
any of the weft to avoid that shedding she just sewed it on and you know kept flipping it going on to the next track flipping it but basically this is how you do it step by step so if you guys enjoyed this video do let me know um and yeah by the way i do use mizani relaxer in case you're wondering um how my hair stays so straight mizani relaxer is the bomb.com so thank you so much for watching and till my next video much love